Surge Protection Device Surge Protective Devices, SPD, are used to protect the electrical installation, which consists of the consumer unit, wiring and accessories, from electrical power surges known as transient overvoltages. They are also used to protect sensitive electronic equipment connected to the installation, such as computers, televisions, washing machines and safety circuits, such as fire detection systems and emergency lighting. SPD has bi-connect terminals for multiple connections and it can be installed in reversible. It also have a lock system for fixing the modules. It can be used for remote signaling. It has four pluggable modules. How does SPD work? At normal operating voltages, the SPDs are in a high impedance state and do not affect the system. When a transient voltage occurs on the circuit, the SPD moves into a state of conduction, or low impedance, and diverts the surge current back to its source or ground. This limits or clamps the voltage to a safer level. After the transient is diverted, the SPD automatically resets back to its high impedance state. Types of SPD Type 1 SPD installed at the origin, that is, main distribution board. Type 2 SPD installed at sub distribution boards. Type 3 SPD installed close to the protected load. They must only be installed as a supplement to Type 2 SPD. Parameters to check SPD performance. Response time. The response time of a given component simply means how quickly the component reacts when the surge threshold is surpassed. Voltage limiting components, TVs diodes, in particular, have faster response times than voltage switching components. Follow on current. Follow on current occurs when a surge protective device fails to turn off, i.e., return to a high impedance state. Following the transient event due to the low voltage drop across the component. This allows current to continue to flow through the device during normal operation. Let through voltage. In the event of a surge, the let through voltage is the amount of voltage the component allows to reach the connected equipment. For let through voltage, diodes limit voltage the best and keep it the lowest. But that advantage is restricted because diodes are not as effective at handling larger surge currents. What are transient overvoltages? Transient overvoltages are defined as short duration surges of electricity which occur due to the sudden release of energy previously stored or induced by other means. Transient overvoltages can be either naturally occurring or man made. How do transient overvoltages occur? Natural transient overvoltages occur due to indirect lightning strikes, most likely to happen due to a direct lightning strike on an adjacent overhead power or telephone line, causing the transient overvoltage to travel along the lines, which can cause significant damage to the electrical installation and associated equipment. Thanks for watching, kindly subscribe and share.